Hello viewers, welcome to another SMC tutorial video. In today's video, I'll be showing us how we can download and use the Nabox wallet. But before we get started, what is a Nabox wallet? Nabox wallet supports multiple blockchain networks. Users can quickly transfer assets to different networks through the cross-chain function of Nabox and participate in the applications of each network. Okay. It is highly compatible with Metamax, Wallet Connect and various other D apps. Nabox also supports ETH, BSC, Hiko, who, that is the Huobi Eco chain and Ukex chain on the Nulls ecosystem. The application layer of this wallet consists of three main models, that is the cross-chain transfer, the cross-chain swap and DApp plugin. Okay, okay, I think this is much better explanation. So we can simply say that Nabox is a wallet that just supports multi-chains and it helps us to transfer um, tokens to transfers across different networks easily. So because with this explanation here, that's simply what Nabox does. It helps with cross-chain transfers, cross-chain swaps, and the apps plugin. Okay, so let's go right ahead to download our Nabox app. Okay, we can do this. Okay, let's check the Nabox. Before we do that, let's check the Nabox website to see what it has to say as well. It says you can download the Nabox app from the App Store. The Google Play Store, we can download using the APK on Android, download on the test flight and available in Chrome Web Store. Let's scroll up to see what else the site says. This is the official website for the Nabox wallet, that is Nabox.io. So let's say the second layer cross chain, okay, one click question for easy swaps across different chains, okay. Works with Metamax, Wallet Connect, and various D apps. Great. Supports digital asset management across Ethereum, BNB, Bitron, OKEX, Chain, Polygon, Tron, KCC, Nulls, Nerve, and a lot more others. Okay. User base, current active users, over 300,000. Interesting. Okay. So these are the chains it supports. Wow. That's a lot. So Nabo supports multiple blockchain networks. You can quickly transfer assets to different networks through the cross chain function. Of Nabox and participate in the applications of each network. Okay, amazing, amazing. These are all the networks that Nabox supports, and I'm sure more will still come in. So, yes, like it says here, we can download from our App Store or Google Play Store. So, let's go right ahead to download our Nabox app. So, just ensure that you're searching for the right Nabox app on the play store and once it comes up you then download and then open up the wallet okay so wait for the wallet to open up great so it says welcome to nabox multi-chain deep gateway okay we select our language and we tap on next we select currency usd and then we tap on next and say for better user experience we need you to authorize the following okay we just say confirm allow allow great so here we're asked to create an account or import an account okay so let's see what create an account is all about great so i believe here we can impute an account name impute a password and then we can agree to the service and privacy policies and next let's see what import accounts is about as well so here we can import via our mnemonic phrase so i believe that if you have a wallet on like uh, your mnemonic phrase from trust wallet can be used on the nabox wallet yes so your 12 word phrase you can tap on import by mnemonic phrase and impute your 12 words here and then you set a password for the nabox wallet and then you can import your trust wallet into the nabox wallet okay so if you already have an existing wallet that you'd like to use on the nabox wallet great go right ahead so for this video i want to create a new account so we tap on create an account and then we put our account name uh let me use smc and then password let's use smc dow one okay it says it's still risky let's just add a symbol great so it works so let's impute that again one the symbol the symbol okay so it's the same and then we agree to with the service and private privacy policies then we tap on next okay so these are the different networks and then we can turn on all others right so what's active by default is the bsc nodes e nodes and nev then we can also turn on the bsc polygon avalanche 
you can, you can turn everything on as you wish you can turn on the tron it seems in a bit tron you can turn on all these other networks and then create your account okay so let's go right ahead and create the account and then it's saying that we should back up the mnemonic phrase okay you can tap this if you want to do that and then it said it says take down your mnemonic phrase for your safety please disconnect from internet when backing up please record your mnemonic phrase on the paper and keep it safely anyone who acquires a mnemonic phrase will have access to your assets okay so let's tap on next all right so for this video purpose only this wallet that has been created just for video purpose only and these are the mnemonic phrases we'll be working with so we need to ensure that we have our mnemonic phrases stored in a safe place like it says for security reasons for your safety disconnect from internet when backing up all right so i want to just ensure that i have all of these um, letters these phrases imputed or written down properly okay so let's see field mention busy universe frequent and ivory okay so let's tap on next and then i should confirm my mnemonic phrase i need to confirm accordingly in the order that it was shown to you in the previous page so that's why i had to write it down so the first word was patrol then we had wolf wolf okay then we had ill then we had lecture where is that okay then we had kind okay then we had text all right then we had field then we had mention then we had busy and then universe then frequent and ivory then you tap on confirm okay great this is the home page for the netbox wallet and we can see that we have our address here and we can see that we have breach that is being a cross chain wallet you can breach you can swap you can send okay and then we can see this tiny qr code and let's see what happens if you tap on it okay great so this is where you can copy your wallet address and then you can also send this qr code to people who want to send uh, money into your account and then or you can just download the picture or take a screenshot and share with the senders also let's say we want to change the network from the ethereum mainnet because by default the nabox wallet opens up on the ethereum mainnet but you can always change to other chains so you just tap on where we have smc and then you can see the drop down see the list of all the networks and you can just change to bsc or polygon but let's see what happens when we tap on bsc great so the entire interface changes we now have bnb the native token on the binance smart chain and then at the top right you can now see the bsc icon all right so for this video this is just a brief overview of what the nabox wallet is all about we'll be having a sequel to this video that explains more functionalities on the netbox wallet i hope this video has been helpful guys and sure you like this video if you have any questions make a comment in the comment section below and rest assured that someone will be available to attend to you and show you subscribe to this channel and tap on that notification bell to get more educated videos like this thank you for watching and see you in the next video